So you've already signed up for Tee Public, and now you're ready to make your cover photo and avatar. And again, this is really important as, as if you're putting your business together, you need to establish some sort of brand. So let's say, for instance, you wanted to start up a cat shirt business. You know, you'd go to Tee Public. Let's find out what's already trending with cat shirts. So I'd go to cat shirts right up above and keep in mind they've got in their built in SEO. So they're going to tell you what the most popular thing is. Now you can do it as far as newest or we can go ahead and we can click on popular. OK, so those are your two options right there. Let's go ahead and click on this one here this cat shirt that we see first. And what's important to note is there's the shirt, there's the shirt name, and here is the artist where it says sold by. We wanna know what their banner looks like, right? Or their cover photo. So there's the cover photo there, and then there's their avatar. So again, whatever you end up picking out, this is sort of your form of branding, but you're wondering about size. What size should you use for your cover photo? Well, as far as size goes, we're gonna go to Canva and show you how to quickly make one up. You want to go to create a design, and we're going to do a thousand by 300 pixels, create new design. And you can see to the left here that Canva might already give you that nudge of what you can use. But if we're say, for instance, using something in the realm of cats, then maybe we want to use something that is going to stick out or represent us as, you know, a cat business. Let's take a look at another one just for inspiration. And you can see just a simple cover photo there. There's the avatar. So we can be inspired by that. And let's just keep it really simple. We've got the size. That was 1,000 by 300. And with Canva, we can just go ahead and go to Elements. And we can put Cat. See what pops up. Let's use this one here. And let's use another one. So now we've got a handful of images there. Let's give it some color in the background. Maybe some design. And again, this is just an example. So now we have our design, and that is the cover photo there. Uh, we're going to go ahead and go back to the home page here. When you want to create your avatar, we're going to keep it simple. We're going to go to create a design, and it's going to be 324 by 324. Let's go back and search for the cat part here, and we'll give this a color background. Maybe a little bit of that design as it relates to the cover photo. We can duplicate that. Okay, so now we've got the cover photo here and we've got the avatar here. Then you can go ahead and start logging in. This is my store, but it's where it says upload new cover photo. You just click there. And then as far as the avatar, avatar upload new icon. So again, that's the easiest way to do it. And those are your measurements and be sure to subscribe for more videos just like this as we keep uploading more info about Tee Public, and we'll get into the nitty gritty of how to really sell designs. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.